Hey, welcome back, y'all. <clears throat> All right, so this is uh, another installment of our Ubuntu series. I thought I put the camera up on here. I thought I might try something a little different here. Um, so we're going to talk about setting up an email client. Let's get some email going in our life. So you got to, once you do a fresh install of Ubuntu, typically, uh, by default, uh, it comes with Thunderbird. Thunderbird Mail. The Thunderbird Mail client. I'm uh, let me fix my screen. I don't want to make sure I overlap anything. I'm visible. Okay. So, uh, let's go back. Let's click on. We're gonna open up the mail client. I'm gonna show you, kind of walk through and show you how to set up your email and get the get that rolling. So, uh, there's nothing set up on here. Look here. You got some easy things here you can do here. Create new account. I want to create a new email account. Man, th their their setup is pretty uh, pretty intuitive. There's not much really uh, manual stuff you have to do. Uh, you got two options: skip the skip this and use my existing email. Excuse me. Uh, I think I'll configure my account later. So, what would you like? Uh, would you like? A new email address uh, no if you don't have one you could do this you know try to search for one I, I I got I have a gmail account I'm gonna go ahead and set that up so let's do that all right that's my name I'm gonna put in G, my gmail information here uh, okay put my password in I want you to remember that so I don't have to log that in every time. Go. See how it actually goes and it, it checks and finds its information. I'm going to use IMAP. You can do two, uh, one of two things. So you have IMAP or you have POP3. Uh, IMAP uh, uses more of a remote folder. So you can, uh, it, it more leaves the email folders and email on the server and you're accessing it remotely or you can do pop three this will actually down actually physically download a copy of your email download it and sync it to your computer so you can do that or do imap i choose to do i like the imap we're going to go that route has our incoming outgoing settings here's our username i'm going to hit done on that looks good to me check and uh, that's about it it says mail sending login information okay we're gonna wait and give it a second here to and uh, make sure it comes up the way it's supposed to oh folks you see that you see it there's my gmail uh, on my folders in my inbox uh, structure and if I click on my inbox Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that, folks. And you see down here, it's downloading. There is, uh, I've got about 25, well, 24, or, oh, oh, I didn't realize I had that much. Well, there's a lot of email I got. So, it, anyway, uh, that was pretty painless. Uh, it's pretty much that easy. Um, I don't, I'm not sure what type of email accounts you all are using, but if you have some, uh, an email account that's uh, other than Gmail, uh, you probably have to find, go to their settings, go to that website, and see if they have those IMAP or POP3 type settings. Typically, they'll they'll have instructions on how to set up an email client. Uh, folks, that's pretty much it. Um, this is real quick. This is going to be a quick, short one. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you liked it. Uh, comment, like, share this video. Um, and if you need any IT help, uh, if you want to be with anybody, be with the best. www.bewit.net. Holler at me. I'll see y'all in the next go round.